Anne from Anne Ellis Angels and here are your card readings for the coming week. These are general readings, so take from them everything that resonates with you, leave anything else behind, but most of all, enjoy a really positive week. I'll be using my teacup tarot deck. Gemini, let's check out your cards for this week, starting the 22nd of May. And from the teacup tarot deck, your overall energy is the four of teacups. And this card says, step back, look at the bigger picture, because there could be a golden opportunity that you haven't quite seen yet. And if we look on the card, She's so focused on these tiny little teacups in the background that sometimes can be the past. She's missing this golden opportunity right beside her of this full teacup and this full teapot. So in a nutshell, stand back, take your time, look at the bigger picture because there could be a golden opportunity waiting for you. Your help or your hurdle, the eight of coins says, take care of all the small details. This is dotting the I's, crossing the T's, reading the small print twice. It's the tiny details that make the big difference. So take your time this week and make sure that everything is thoroughly researched. Your guidance here, the three of pencils comes in and says, this is a time of healing and moving on. Taking your time, just having a break and then being ready to move on with this wonderful new opportunity. And it could be in a new direction. How can we help ourselves? Card five, unity comes in. This is about teaching, mentoring, discussions. It's everybody sitting around the table, bringing their expertise for the benefit of everybody else. So it's working well with other people, talking things over, teaching, mentoring, and working out a really good way forward. Pulling it all together, the magician says, you are ready. You can do it. You have everything you need. So there's a lovely dose of self-confidence for you. And the Ace of Pencils as the final outcome card brings in clarity and new ideas. It's finding out what works and moving forward with that. It's sometimes going through a learning phase and if we look at the card here look she's missed with the first few arrows at the target but that's where the learning part comes in now she's hit the bullseye she's got the clarity she understand what works she's worked out these new ways of doing things and is moving forward with those so just to summarize the tarot cards Step back, look at the bigger picture. There could be an opportunity right there for you. Look at all the small details. Take your time, read the small print twice. Take care of all those tiny details. It's a time of resting, relaxing, healing and moving on. Talking things over, discussing things, working with other people. And then knowing that you can do it, you've got everything you need and acting on those brilliant new ideas. So let's just clarify with the Time to Shine deck. The Five of Life says stay positive. Focus on what you do have and ask for any help if you need it. That's a real sign of strength, asking for help. So stay positive. And focus on what you have. You've got more resources than you think you have. The seven of thought is about you following your new plans, focusing now on your needs and moving forward with optimism, closing the door on the old ways. This is where this clarity comes in. You've worked out 
what does work, but just as importantly, you've realized what isn't working and that can help you just as much. And it's closing the door on those old ways. And now new direction, focusing on your needs. The four of emotion. Now we've got a double message here. It's the same card from a different deck. And again, wonderful opportunities coming your way, but stand back and look at the bigger picture. The nine of thoughts says, choose your thoughts with care. Focus on what could go right. So there's some lovely mindfulness here this week of really being careful to remain optimistic and positive. Choose your thoughts with care. The eight of emotion, you're clearly going to do that. This is about a positive move forward, a change of direction, and you moving towards something good. And your final outcome card here says, take your time, talk things over, rest, relax. We were talking about that here. Make your decisions later, but talk things over. Just take your time this week. So really, this is a week when I'm looking at these cards overall to just take your time. Think it all through. Stay awake for these new opportunities. Just talk things over. Definitely communication with other people to get the clarity that you need. And once the clarity and the new ideas are there, there is a lovely energy of moving forward, new direction, new plans, moving towards something good. And after all that, thinking it through, taking your time, reflecting and taking care of all the small details. When you've done all that homework, you'll be ready and you'll have everything you need. And there, it, that's you flying high and moving in that wonderful new direction. So I hope you've enjoyed the reading. If you have, click that subscribe button, make the bell ring. Thank you for doing that. It makes a huge difference to me. And then you'll get notified when I do the next reading for you as well. So take care now and I'll see you soon. Thank you.